Hello everybody, my name is Vivian Mertz and in the next few minutes I will show you how to directly draw a roof from Google Maps and use said roof for your project in the Polyson constructor. I already prepared a project. This project is located in Winterthur, Switzerland. As you can see, we already got a location from Google Maps. Now we change to a new tab called Roof. And with custom elevation, we can add a roof from Google Maps, Bing, or you can upload your own CAD file or upload a picture of the roof as JPEG and then redraw it in the Polyson constructor. To open the map drawer, you go to Draw Import up here. First, you get this greeting message with some tooltips to the map drawer. You can close it for now and if you need help later on, just click on this question mark in the bottom left corner. You can always reopen it. Now we want to draw our roof. We change from Canvas to Google. So I want to draw this roof. As you can see, we've got two interferences on it. A big one and a smaller one and we've got the parapet around our roof. Now we're starting up with um, setting some reference lines which is the following symbol on your toolbar. These lines will help us to draw a roof more easily. You can always zoom in for more precision. Once we set our reference lines, we can change to the pen tool over here. and start drawing our roof. So now thanks to the lines, this will be very easy to connect. And with the hand symbol, it closes our roof. Now this window here on the right appeared called details and we can set a height for our roof. Let's say it's 10 meters. Now let's go to our interference area. We can easily delete those lines. We don't need them anymore. And for the interference area, we can set new lines. So we can already set a height here. Let's say this is one meter. Now we want to draw our second interference. This one is a little bit smaller and it's also not as geometrical as the first one. So we'll just draw this by hand without any reference lines. We can again set a height. This is crucial later on for the polyson constructor to calculate the right amount of shadowing your objects will cast on your PV modules. Now let's zoom out again. We've set both our interferences the more time you take, of course, the more accurate your interferences will be marked. 
Now with this big arrow A tool, um, you will set the direction, meaning you'll mark the south side of your roof. Once you got it, you can save it up here. And in the next step, you will have to add the snow load and the wind load. And afterwards, you continue um, choosing your PView models. Thanks a lot for your attention and enjoy the Polysan Constructor.